The brachial plexus is a network of nerves that stem from the spinal cord in the neck. Each nerve of the brachial plexus comes out of the spinal cord as a nerve root. These nerve roots divide and combine like subway tracks to eventually become the nerves of the shoulder, arm, and hand. What exactly is a nerve? Nerves are bundles of fibers that carry messages to and from the brain. The brain sends messages along nerves that tell muscles how to move and also carry sensory information back to the brain. The nerves of the brachial plexus are most commonly injured during birth, if the baby's neck is stretched going through the birth canal, called shoulder dystocia. But the brachial plexus can also be injured at any time in our lives that our neck is overstretched or injured through impact, such as during tackle football. When a nerve is injured, the muscles don't receive the right information on how and when to move. Fortunately, brachial plexus injuries are usually not painful. However, a brachial plexus injury can cause other issues as your child develops. When brachial plexus nerves are injured in a baby, the affected muscles around the shoulder don't stretch and grow properly. This leads to limitations in shoulder joint movement, called a contracture. Fortunately, brachial plexus injuries are treatable and may even heal on their own within weeks or months following an injury. The extent of your child's injury and treatment options will depend on where exactly the injury occurred, how badly the nerves are damaged, and whether the shoulder joint is growing properly. Sometimes the nerves have only been stretched, called neuropraxia, or partially torn. These types of injuries may heal on their own over the course of a few weeks or months. If the nerves are completely torn, either at the nerve roots, called a rupture, or torn from the spinal cord itself, called an avulsion, it is less likely to heal on its own, and surgical repair may be their elbow by two months of age, it is important to see a specialist. Your child will have a physical exam, and a specialized therapist may recommend stretches or physical therapy to help your child's injury heal. Additional imaging such as ultrasound and MRI scans may be necessary in order to diagnose the injury. Your brachial plexus specialist will track your child's progress and will be able to inform you if any further treatments are necessary.